Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is the 2022 Happier Camper HC1 Adaptive Model. This one is the off-road model and it is lifted, so let me show you around. There is a foldable entrance step, a light right here with a switch used to turn it on and off, big opening window, Check out the aggressive tires. It has stabilizers. Back here, it has a little tow hitch so you can bring along some bikes. Opening window right here in the back. And let's open this up. This is a very large opening, great for loading and unloading large items. And due to the adaptive nature of the interior, you can easily transport large items. Now here on the other side is the solar input, 30 amp connection, gray water, and the water connection. Really big window that does open right here on the side. Some more stabilizers. Now this is a swing away tow hitch. It does have a breakaway system. There's a manual crank. There is even a level indicator built onto the frame here. Nice big opening window right here. Let's open this up. Now there is a nice catch here for the door. And right here on the door, there is this nice shade that can help give you some privacy. And they have included this big pouch right here on the door. So let's check out the interior. And this is what it looks like inside. All right, so now let me show you around the interior. So right at the entranceway, there are four 110 outlets, a 12 volt, and two USB ports. There's this long seating area. When you pull up on the cushion, there's a little bit of storage. And this one has the battery. Up above, there's a big opening window bug screen, privacy shade. Adjustable push light. Upper cabinets that slide to open. Now this is where the kitchen area is located. It comes with a portable little stove top and this is the sink, flip-up faucet, and that's the sink. This is portable and you can reconfigure it in any area that you wish. Now this underneath is where the water is. And right below that is a little refrigerator. 12 volt right there and the refrigerator is plugged into it there's some countertop extensions here on each side big window over here big screen on this side this window does open up and a pull down privacy shade some more upper cabinets Another push light. Big window in the back that does open. Pull down shade and pull up bug screen. 
on this side another adjustable push light. Upper cabinets. Another window with a screen. The window does open up and again, privacy shade and... And located on this side of the entrance doorway is the fire extinguisher. Up above here, there's the light switch. The air vent, which is right here. So now this makes a great seating area, nice big table that you can dine on or work on. Now I'm going to show you how to make this into a bed area. So now this bed is made for one person currently. I used the tabletop that I had showed you previously and put the backrests down on it. Now if you want to make it a bigger bed, you go over and grab this tabletop set it down here and then put the rest of the cushions right on top. Now I also want to show you that each cube has storage. So that is great. Now this interior doesn't have to stay in the configuration that it's already in. This is actually very adaptive, very modular. All these little cubes here are reconfigurable, so you can easily pick them up and remove them and place them in any configuration you desire. So let me show you. So if you wanted to reconfigure the interior, first thing you do is pull up one of the mats, and then you go towards the cube that you want to use and they're very lightweight, and you place them wherever you want. Now, I can sit right here, and I have a side table to enjoy a beverage. Now, what's so versatile about this is that you can also use some of these interior components as outdoor furniture. You can actually grab this little tabletop, set it outside, along with a couple of cubes, because these are made out of sunbrella fabric, and you can just sit outdoors. Let me show you. This is what it looks like when you bring them outside. So I hope you enjoyed this quick tour of the Happier Camper. Now, although it doesn't have a bathroom, it does have a nice kitchen, which you can also bring outside along with the furniture that I showed you. I love that it's configurable, so whatever your preference is, can just imagine it and then do it. Thank you so much for joining me today. Please subscribe to my channel and join me for some more videos. Bye for now.